Hello, ladies, yes, and salt elementals. Is the paradox gunslinger trying to unlock two remote? Go! It is a mounting load of shit. A minigun. This is the gungeon saying, you know what? I'm gonna throw you a bone, just like Spelunky does, and with the bloody eye, which slows the enemy projectiles. I'm telling you, man, the gungeon's like, you seem to be in pain and in misery. I'm going to throw you a bone. If you can't pull this off with these tools, you don't deserve to even play this game to maybe just give up forever. That's what you should you should do. As a result of losing, so let's just minigun the crap out of these people. Back to um, Turo mode. Because I've noticed, like, there's no improvement. <laughs> there's no difference in the damage I take and in the time that it takes. It's just... Like, if I'm going to take just as much damage and be just as bad, why not do it on Turo mode where I have even more fun? Like, don't get me wrong, regular speed, I still have a great time in the gungeon. Man, that's uh, doing short work out of my enemies. For sure. Yep. Get wrecked. Um... Let's do it even better. With two remote enabled. Fun times. We shouldn't be using the minigun, but it's a great, great fun time to destroy every single one of my enemies. I love two remote and how insanely out of control it gets. Love it. And still just as good. Which is to say, just as bad. You know? So, I got you covered, fam. I'm just going to let that last uh, come and linger. Oh boy! Finally! Is this the first run in three or four that we get a key finally at the very beginning on the first level where I don't have to actually buy it? Fantastic. Let's just keep on going. Man, Turo Mode feels great after playing in uh, regular speed for a little while. It's like, oh man, this is why I loved it so much. I'm so glad that I enabled regular mode for a little while to get an extra appreciate ooh ooh i want it in here i want it but we have a great gun so we're going to leave it alone until we find until we find the boss ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's see if we can get a kill here because that achievement is still a thing that needs to happen at least one of my straight bullets cannot destroy that barrel I'm still trying, still going to do it to that rat fight, even though it's kind of uh, counterproductive in the sense that it might end my run there. I'll uh, feel like if I don't do the rat and get everything that I want from the rat, usually you get a key out of those anyway, but I think I'm gonna pass. Um, oh! Fell into the rat, I feel like bullet hell just will just kill me. Oh wow, that was slightly more dangerous than I had any right to need to be. Is that getting so that was stupid. I was going to blank. I was still operating under the assumption that I can react to the shot. So once more, you fail miserably to kill the first level boss without suffering damage. In the silliest way possible, so often, doesn't it? Oh my goodness, what a pile of garbage you just gave me. What's this? What is this? And it gives you curse too. Because it's a melee weapon, I bet. Uh, we'll have two keys. I had to buy one. Because there is a 0% chance I will not open this. Ooh, that looks like something I might have synergy with the other one. No? No? Liquid Valkyrie doesn't have synergy with the other... <laughs> other... Wow, really? I guess the synergy is just built in. I need to have 39 shots with this thing. They're going to be very helpful. Oubliette is down there. There's no key that I can use. So we just get junk. That one can't even access that one, so what can I gonna do about it? Did I shoot the walls here? Pretty sure there's nothing. I don't know why I'm shooting that because that makes no sense. Might as well deplete it, it's already depleted. Uh Blink! Aha! Uh -huh. 
You get nothing. Okay. <laughs> just go over here. Get out of this nonsense place. Into trash land we go. And it's going to be worth it. Don't worry about it. It's no, no pain, no gain. I am in, in an enormous amount of pain right now. Look at my arsenal right now. The minigun's great. It does run out of ammunition very, very quickly. What the hell happened to that guy? He just collapsed from AIDS in front of me. He just could not take it anymore. And he saw my face and he was just uh, completely blinded by my radiance. Or maybe just looking upon the paradox. That's a very high chance of your brain just collapsing upon itself. Okay, so we need that ammunition for the minigun for uh, the boss fight or it will be the most miserable experience of our lives. So let's do that. This is such trash. I can't even possibly put in enough scathing words to say how enormously disappointed I am in this gun, if you want to call it that. And apparently it seems to combo sometimes or maybe it just does extra damage if you if you um, focus on it a little bit or maybe it's random you sometimes get a mega punch out of it that being said i mean it is the infinite ammunition no it's not i have no idea what i'm talking about kabumo and there is some stunning like it's not a hundred percent garbage but the trash range and trash damage like the damage is, is not good i think it just charges up oh the ruby bracelet i really want this i am willing i am willing to sacrifice the rat run run to grab that and upgrade it at the blacksmith in fact we might intentionally avoid the rat Ooh. we might intentionally avoid the rat just to have a sure shot at upgrading the ruby bracelet because I'm not going to forget it again it doesn't show up that often I really want to get that unlocked and I assume that it's not something you have to do every time you simply take it to the lady and she will upgrade it permanently this is so pretty good so far making do with this trash gun and you know what? The curse is not 100% unwelcome. <laughs> of all the things I could have spawned to get the super punch, it had to be a tiny bat. Yeah, having a, such a much fun, so much, much more fun time with Turo mode enabled. I don't care if it's harder. I don't care if it means that we have to attempt this a million times more. Much rather have. Have a fantastic time with it. So these guys are definitely not shroomers. The amount has not gone down from 12. Nice. You know what? That's really not that bad. Maybe stop trashing this gun that much. Like, it's not super garbage. Ooh. That's our curse. Rearing its ugly head. Ah, I can't just... <laughs> Got trapped in the scenery. I'm pretty sure it's not charge up, it's just random. Yeah, see it randomly it randomly super powered super punches. Now and then I have no room here. I need more ammunition. But yeah, my arsenal not not the absolute greatest I've ever conceived. I would not under any circumstance say. We are in an overpowered situation. Definitely willing to say we are hideously underpowered, especially when I throw myself into the gunk like an utter fool. The table take flipping is no longer, no longer viable. I like to get punched around the corner. I'm a mugger. I'm gonna mug you around this corner. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, la, la, la. Another one by the dust. Oh yeah, super duper punch. Kaboom! I do like that, uh, you know, knockback is cool. 
The knockback is cool, sometimes it stuns. Uh, it's growing on me. It's not great. Again, this gun is growing on me. Okay. Ah, what the? It's so infuriating. I uh, get distracted by all the pretty colors, okay? Uh, we'll probably end up. Probably end up uh, destroying that chest. Because keys are so hard to come by for some reason. Like it used to be. Never have any problems with keys anymore. Now and then, I might not be able to open a chest here and there, but I've been destroying so many chests lately. Kind of mad. Ending. Mad ending. Okay. Seems like the super just completely destroys whatever spawns after, too. Oh, Support game shot. How is this our best weapon? I don't know, man, but it, it truly is. <laughs> it is the best I can do right now. I mean, obviously, the minigun is better, but we need that for the boss. Not like the blob you lowered. It's something that needs a boss killer, but, you know. Do I feel lucky, punk? Or do I feel like I'm going to get destroyed by the blobby lord? Let's just assume I won't, okay? Let's assume I won't. Let's say the blobby lord is going to give me a little bit of a hard time. But it's not going to completely destroy me. Already halfway there. Two blanks. I afford to use one. Get me out, so here we are with our default weapon. But you know, it's a giant blob of nonsense. Should be able to destroy it without dying. Like, uh, I'm not saying I'm gonna get zero damage done to me. It's unlikely it's going to do three points of damage from here to the end, right? I'm just stand here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's changing directions on me. This is all I've done all day long. Recording that into the gungeon. I'm just too damn salty not to. We're going to get that unlocked, damn it. Oh, we got some armor, we got some health, and we got a shot bow. All of which are garbage! <laughs> uh, once again, where are all the keys? My lord, where are all the keys? There's just no keys dropping from bosses anymore. Cannot remember the last time I saw a key drop from a boss. This room is the most stressful room. I hate that. I absolutely hate that so much. <laughs> and of course, the crest is protected behind a, behind a, another lock. What's there to buy here? So, with our three points of health. Do we want to buy this key? Nah. Still a big decision whether I want to make the... I'm going to assume this ruby bracelet is going to be upgraded to the greatest thing ever conceived. Ooh, bananas. Bananas are cool. What do you guys think? How much for a key? 30, right? Where the hell... Come on. 30? Blank here. You get absolutely nothing out of it. No rat. Ruby bracelet all the way. Okay. It's an active item. Not going to bitch about it. Um, already shot these things. It's pretty much a matter of luck. Let's go to the... Outer worlds over here. Nope. Let's go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I opened the chest. Okay, never mind. I'm like, I need to destroy the chest. But no. Done with the trash land. Not going to the rat. Here I am, trying my absolute darndest. That's our okay, yeah. Okay. I'm alright with these bananas. Absolute darndest. <laughs> Ghost. Haunted me. From behind my back. Yeah, I don't know about these bananas in the sense of, uh, might be a better save for the boss to help for have. All the explosions. It's really hard to aim those shots. But what else am I going to do? The shot bow? Please. I guess the shot bow. 
I do have a jar full of bees. Just throw at my enemies. I watch them go into an aphylactic shock. Or just simply die from a horrendous pain of being stung by seven bees at once. Hello. Oh, you're being buffed. There's no way I can destroy you now. I hate you. I guess we'll just have to do this uh, the hard way. Uh, this is bad. Please don't. <laughs> no, don't do this to me. <laughs> oh. You piece of gar- You piece of garbage! I thought you were totally catatonic. I was about to take great pleasure in your demise. Well, this is annoying. Woo! Please don't destroy me again. Alright. Need some extra cash. The shop is what I'm using. This is the gun that I'm using to kill enemies. Yep, yep, this is happening. It's not like complete garbage. <laughs> well, when you when the best thing you can say about the things that you have is like, it's not complete garbage. <laughs> You're not doing so great. Buy those remote bullets. I don't really even know what they do. I assume that you can just aim every object that can be guided after after they're fired. Seems like a pretty good thing with a shot bow. What? Why was there only one? Oh, because ooh. It's an excellent thing with a shot bow, because now everything is all clumped together. You're not missing a single shot. Pretty cool. Well, those bees were wasted. That's pretty awesome. I like guided bullets. Nope. Well, maybe now the bananas will actually land on my enemy. Ooh. Well, I do wish I hadn't wasted my money. <laughs> I mean, it's not a waste. Because it was a good item to buy. I was just now very excited about it. Well, there's no way I can open that. Um, but I think Elder Blank is slightly better, huh? Yep, yep. Perfectly planned. Oh, wow. What an excellent series of dodges. I love how every single arrow is landing inside of his their bellies. And it's still not enough damage to one-shot them. That's how much trash the shot bow is. Oh, that was good. I really like that, though. I really like the homing shots. The point is like... Yeah, Elder... Bla Ooh, I want that! Kiki, kiki, kiki. Ooh, really? Really? Quite the boon. Right there, throwing that key piece of trash. Uh, happily, I noticed it. Recently, there was a run that I did not notice it. I could have really, really used it. His homing shots working really nicely. I want some ammunition though. I want that minigun to be uh, back because the bananas are not gonna cut it against the boss. These ammo drops not happening. I mean, the shovel might be decent against the boss now that we have uh, the homing shots here. I mean, they're pretty okay damage. You are not a mimic. And we have opened another. I mean, encounter another chest. And we did find a key. And we have encountered the entirety of the level. 24 shells. There's no way I can open. Uh, I can buy that Elder Blank, unfortunately. So, let's open this. The Predator. I was not impressed with it. 24 shells. How much? 30. I guess we're going to the boss and uh, hoping not to die. I assume the Predator is the best uh, thing we got. We should swap between Bananas and Predator, I guess. Or maybe just deplete the Shot Bow. Let's see how much damage the Shot Bow does. You know what? That's not bad at all. There's also the... The Beast happening there. Uh, Alright, Bananas. I have to charge them. Yeah, that's not gonna work out, is it? Oh boy. Where's the ad? I can't even see it. I think it's dead because of the banana. I'm gonna blank that out because I was feeling very, very nervous. I think it's, it was the bees doing all, most of the damage there. You know what? The predator's not bad. That's some decent good, some damn good, decent damage against the boss. Alright. Slowly. Getting out of this awful slump. Is this a, the AWP? 
Or is this just a sniper rifle, the M16? Sniper rifle! Happy to have it. Does this even discover secret rooms? Oh no! One blank. Might as well use it. We often use it in the shop. Must not be any different. Nothing here. Uh, enough to buy this key. Yeah, let's open this. It should be a passive. Angry bullets. I'm happy. I uh, know homing bullets. Oh, homing bullets are they? Like a complete redundancy. With uh, why do they both exist? I mean, homing bullets are automatic. Wonder if they contradict one another, and now the the bullets are not going to have any idea what they're doing. Oh, that's underwhelming. Well, we leave. Looking pretty good. Looking actually pretty good. Happy with it. The Predator was surprisingly high damage against the boss. Um, and the sniper rifle is a fantastic thing to have now. Not very good with the uh, homing bullets, though. Like, it's not going to have any kind of interaction with it. I mean, you can curve bullets like your Angelina Jolie in 2005, but... Was it 2005? I don't know. It was like a Matrix offspring wanted that movie. It was not very good. Trying to ape the hype on uh, the Matrix stuff. So that's why I said 2005. It seems like it was. it's from the same era. Yeah, this sniper rifle is fantastic. I love it. Doing lots of damage too. Very, very pleased with it. Well done. Just stand there while a blobulet gives you a hug. That's just the way I like to do things. All affection. I accept it no matter the source. I embrace it. I mean, it's not incredible. Because we still have to two-shot these guys. Right, destroy these dumbasses with their stupid bubbles. Carry on to the next area. Hello. Well, this is an upsetting room. I hate it. <laughs> I absolutely hate it. Thankfully, though, we got pretty lucky on the, the enemy distribution. Another shop. We got the Napalm Strike. You know what? I'm pretty also I'm pretty impressed with the um, with the jar full of bees. Yeah. Well, all right. Work case are, huh? <laughs> Fine, whatever. Sniper rifle. The predator was also nice. I'm going to keep the predator uh, for the boss. I could get rid of this and the shot bow. Let's do it. Maybe we'll get something slightly more, slightly more exciting than these two pieces of garbage. Gamma Ray, not an exciting weapon, but it is a beam weapon with all the benefits that that entails. I like beam weapons, just some principle because they're cool. But everybody is just gonna get sniped from afar. And I just need a damage upgrade. With the sniper rifle to be. I thought that I dodged around that bullet, but I actually touched it. I defer to your judgment, Gungeon. If you say I did, I believe you. I believe you. Your programming is solid. Hey, there's another boss fight. I think I still think the Vulcan cannon, I keep calling it minigun. It's still the best weapon that we have against bosses. So here's the Threatnaught. Which I constantly fail miserably. Like, oh jeez, the... <laughs> the auto-aim bullets, or rather, the hand-aim bullets. So you have one blank. Really liking it though. Very happy with this Vulcan cannon. What was that? I mean, there was a... Uh, something... This Vulcan cannon is absolutely boss fight. Total boss killer. It does run out of ammunition quite quickly, though. Ah, is this a key? Amazing! They still drop it as bosses. Damn! All right. Oh, of course, they're lowercase r. We can use it. This is the the amazing use of the lowercase r. You shoot walls to discover secret rooms. That's its functionality. Uh, back to the sniper. You know what? Yeah, I'm back to sniper. 
uh, if we ever find that fabled, I think it's called Ammonition Drop. I think that's how it's pronounced. I, I see it so seldom that I've kind of forgotten what's even named. But if we ever get one of those fabled items of, of past fables, yes, of legend. It will be go. It will be going for the Vulcan cannon. So let's deplete the sniper rifle. Then we'll switch to the uh, predator. Well, I'm slightly trapped here, so it's taking it easy. How about you drowning a sea of bees? Just come back. Finally, a bunch of keys. We'll, hey, the, now that I don't need it, there's the rats. Very easily noticeable. Five more shots here. The sniper. Rifle, open that up. That's the Polaris! Absolute favorite gun. Absolute favorite. Love it, love it, love it. Hmm. Instantly becomes the, the gun that I want to use for everything. Of course, it depends on you being good with it. Because you need to kill a bunch of enemies with it. But if we can make it work. We can make it work. It's just a matter of killing enough enemies. Level 2 is already, like, really good. Level 3 is OP as hell. So we can get the kills. To make it work, that will be fantastic. So don't... Fill me up with salt, you weirdos. Hate that you spawn bullets all over the place. There's level 2. Nice. Level 2 already makes it super worth using. Level 1, very lackluster. Level 2... Excellent weapon. Level 3. You have achieved god mode. Haha, <laughs> now all the keys are dropping. Now I don't need them anymore. I mean, I do need them, but not that much. Ooh, there's a synergy. I was about to say, I don't want this, but there's a synergy. Probably should have waited until that could have been used. I don't want to change or swap away from it, though. I don't think swapping makes it bad, actually. It's getting hit. Did that always happen before? <laughs> Where are you, Polaris? See, it doesn't. Pretty sure we already discovered the secret room. Uh, there's a synergy. I must I must keep synergies. I must. Mm, 67. Shells. What's your problem, fella? <laughs> oh, because I shot this thing. Like, jeez, you don't have to be aggressive like this. I never did anything wrong to you. I guess I can just go get the free health and we'll be out of here. Hello. Yes, yes, indeed. Give me this half heart. Amazing. Another thing I'm pretty sure it exists, but we haven't seen it in forever, is those vampire NPCs. It'll be amazing to get just free money. We're good to go, right? No chests, nothing. I, I just don't trust myself. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Is this the forge already or is this the, the hollow? Forget. I think it's the hollow. Yeah. Still we got a ways to go. Um, let's check out this banana, see how it does. With the horn. Wonder which. Oh man, the homing bananas are hilarious. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not impressed. I'm impressed. I don't see any synergies, which means probably it's just the horn doing it. Go back to Polaris. That's where it's at. There you are. Hello. Death upon you. Oh, there was a key. Let me just flank everything out so I can find the key. damn key. Totally worth it, I think. Spending the blank to get that sweet, sweet key. These homing shots are really awesome. And like little flit glows. Homing against my enemy. Blowing up their chests and organs. One of these days, though, one of those fabled uh, ammo drops will happen, and the prophecy will be complete. It's only a one in a million chance, however, though, so I wouldn't hold my breath. Okay, there's still somebody. This is the biggest room of all time. Please go away. Oh, moly, that took forever. All right, the horn happens, and I don't see no bananas happening. Hornucopia. I don't understand. Hey, level 3 Polaris. Get utterly wrecked, noobs. 
Mm -hmm. All right, that's a Winchester rifle. <laughs> Bunch of keys that I no longer need. So this shop is utter garbage. We carry on in our mission to upgrade this uh, Rui bracelet. I don't want to do this. Can I maybe avoid doing it? <laughs> I hate trap rooms. I hate them. Oh boy, these people are volunteered to taste the amazing power of Polaris. Yeah. Trying to kill this comeback. All right. Yeah, we're gonna have to do the trap room, aren't we? Yeah. Uh huh. Alrighty. Ooh, just, just, just. You know what? I'm a little underwhelmed right now. I think they they did. Ooh, oh, oh, almost chased that gun, that, that bullet. Still chasing the bullet. Um, they did nerf the Polaris a while back, a long while back. So it's definitely worse than it used to be. It's still pretty good though. I'll open that right away. Oh, that's very happy to get that. And the weirdo. Don't really need money right now, but I could use more inventory space. Get rid of this gamma ray piece of garbage. Actually, you should keep everything, just in case you get an incredible synergy, right? If you don't need the money, just pass on uh, throwing things away. All right, let's hope not to receive damage in this trap room. I didn't actually look at it closely. Maybe it's really easy. Maybe not bad. A little too close to that, everyone. Made it. Okay. Two shotting those ghosts. Definitely fantastic. And of course, we're going to use the Polaris against the boss. This is an all around, all do everything weapon. As long as you don't receive damage. As long as it's level 3. Even level, level 2, I will still use it against the boss, I think. Oh boy. Sometimes that's worth it, sometimes it's not. I would say that point of armor was worth pursuing. No, we just need to find the rest of the enemies. Stop giving me these freaking spiders! Alright. Another room complete. Looking forward to that boss fight. Man. Filthy buff master. Thankfully, I was able to obliterate everything that he stands for. There's just so many rooms here. It's out of control mutation. Very happy to get it. And with a synergy, huh? A s different one. Whoa. <laughs> Pretty damn badass looking amazing. Uh, but of course, Polaris. Thankfully, we've been receiving enough bullets, enough guns that the complete dearth of ammunition has been moot not affected my i mean it has affected my gameplay it's not been a deal breaker everybody dies this room seems enormous i mean this level i think i wanted to do the boss before i suffer damage and the polaris stuff being so amazing kill pillars can i turn one against no Fortunate. Mm -mm. Oh, that was so close. Wow, that was close. Oh, that's right. It's like, what's going on? This is... Oh, you piece of garbage. I I missed press the key. And instead of going diagonally, I went horizontal. That's what happened there. Uh, it's like, what's going on? This banner is so different. It's because of the double slowdown of the bullets. You know what? This damage is garbage. <laughs> Mutations is not doing great. Not doing great, okay? So I managed to take damage and use my blank. Not impressed with my performance. Also, the mutation is uh, making it a little difficult to control the roll. Wow, this damage is so underwhelming. But thanks to the speed of the enemies, I I'm just going to deplete this gun. Uh, thanks to the speed of the bullets, this would have been a, such an easy ace. Alright, let's swap. Right there, I suppose. They messed up spectacularly with the freaking Polaris. 
There's no reason to use this horn. I don't know why I expressed it again. It does help quite a bit to have those homing shots. None, no shots get wasted. Unfortunately, didn't get the ace. Got a little bit of armor on the Coltake 1851. Another underwhelming piece of garbage of a gun. It's okay though. I have a sniper rifle with four shots. And I have a Polaris with at least seven shots. Ah, oh, Jesus! <laughs> Just. Bleh! Yeah, yeah. Might as well use the entirety of the thing. Alright, well, you, here you are in the place where you are no longer necessary. Thank you so much for mocking me so. Let's go back to the Polaris with these 16 shots. We're going to kill 16 enemies. Where's the scumbag? Let's buffing. Oh, well, the 16 shots are depleted. Probably going. This guy's going to get cursed as well. There you are. Damn weirdo. All right. This shop was the absolute worst shop we have ever encountered. Right? It was terrible. Yup. What about the key? Ammunition, it does exist. You just had to pay money for it. So, Polaris or Vulcan Cannon? I think we kind of need Polaris. There's, just do that. And uh, we have a whole bunch of health stored. There's no reason not to do this. At least uh, play this like three times. Just, just hit that key until I get drained of blood entirely. I'm pretty sure we have at the very least two hearts stored, so this is looking okay. 127. Go here. That was just half a heart. No, it's a full heart. What do you have, friendo? You little weirdo. Just half. Alright, we're good. No reason to do anything. Other than leaving. Polaris is full ammunition. Zero ammo drops. I cannot stress this enough. It's just so bizarre. But... <laughs> No ammo drops at all have happened. Let's see if we can get enough kills with this thing. Some strange lighting effect on the conveyor belt there. Oh yeah, everybody gets pwned. Like it's the intern in 2008. Everybody gets pwned. You're not intimidating me anymore, Mr. Hammer. Something I love about Turo mode. The traps become so much easier. Because of the boost to speed. But the traps kind of stay the same speed. So. You get that chance. To outrun them. Come on. Give me that level 3, baby. Ammunition. Amazing. Where are you, Vulcan? I mean, Polaris. Like, we have no shortage. No shortage of guns. Horn. <laughs> What? Just, just keep panic rolling until you get somewhere safe. <laughs> my friendo has uh, destroyed my enemy. Well done, friendo. Now this horn, I would so much rather have. So much rather have. The beehive. The jar full of bees. But, you know. Another key. Uh, there was a synergy, I had to have it. What is this? I'm confused. Thing with the homing gu uh, shots, they are completely ignoring the enemy. Hey, level three. That took forever. That took a long time to reach. Just wait a couple seconds. You'll see me lose it. Eee! It's funny. Run on top of me. How dare you, dastardly, dastardly devil! Continue on. Continue finding all kinds of victims. Oh yeah. You work for me now. Let go of your previous allegiances and swear fealty to my cause. You may probably not be betrayed if you serve me well. You fall. You got killed with the rest. Okay. I need to get this <laughs> Really? <laughs> oh man, that's still to this day is my biggest gungeon gripe. Uh, ow. My biggest Gungeon gripe of all time, and it will continue to be until the end of days. This is so bad. 
It's just not working, man. It will continue to be until the end of the world. It's how bullets don't disappear when the enemies are dead. You feel you're safe. You're like, okay, all the enemies are dead. I'm good. But no. You're still going to get screwed. This was the most pointless room ever conceived. Uh, still going to get super screwed. By a straggling bullet. Isn't that amazing? This is like triple... Triple homing shots with the Predator here. He's got the auto homing shots, the homing shots that go to my cursor, and the Predator homing in as well. Amazing. We do have three keys. Happy to see this. That was some, some nasty damage there. Almost destroyed the whole key all by itself. So the Predator is, is some high damage stuff. Um, keep going. Trying to find that lady. And I am ever so excited to see what the ruby bracelet gets upgraded to. It better be amazing. Or I'm going to be mad that I forewent the rat fight. Well, off you go, fella. You're not the smartest, are you? Well done. You're in good company. You're in good company, sir. The smarts are not, not our forte. Okay, this looks simple enough. This is an easy ass uh, trap room indeed. Alright, just continue predating all of these filthy monsters. It's like, you get a lot of damage. Oh, stealth. Oh, yeah. Nobody here, bitches! Go F yourselves! Now you work for me! <laughs> Kill each other. Okay, this is <laughs> enough, enough foolishness. Need to remember that though. It's pretty useful. Whenever I'm in a hairy situation. Hello, sir. Let's just go across this corner and destroy more of my enemies. Just looking for the last chest and, of course, looking for the shop that will enable me you know, to upgrade that ruby bracelet. I was told in the comments, really good stuff. I don't know if it's like even when it was not described to me. So it didn't go as far as saying, oh, it's, it's just run breaking. Uh, why am I not stealthy anymore? Probably because I rolled and I destroyed something. Makes sense. I made a whole bunch of noise that det detected me. A little bit of logic in the insane Gungeon rules. Actually, the Gungeon is pretty logical place. It is wacko logic, but consistent. I guess just sniper shots, right? But nothing better. Yeah. Sniper shots. Or maybe the mutation because it's so great to clear rooms. Nah, the sniper is just so reliable. Let's go with it. Hey, again we we meet again. Space friend. No no no, don't use a single Vulcan shot. Dumbass piece of garbage. One of these days we'll find that shop and it will be glorious. Um Sniper. Hello? Hmm. Ooh, duct tape. Duct tape is a no-brainer. So what do we want to combine? I did get a few tips. It's like combine something with lots of ammunition, combine it with something powerful, and you get a gun with a million points of ammunition that does a lot of damage. I feel like making like the Vulcan and the mutation would not that not be utterly insane? Just for from a just from a entertaining standpoint, just because it's going to be so entertaining, we're going to do that. Mutation. There you go. We got the Mutavulcan cannon. I guess the mutation cannon. Yeah, mutation cannon. That works. Potion lead skin, a hundred percent better than this piece of garbage. That is the the horn. But off you go. I don't know. I don't know if that's good, but it's going to entertain me. That's all that matters to me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I approve. I approve. I don't think it was the best combination we could have come up with. But I'm happy with it. That's all that I care about. Hey, we finally found it. Hey, I see you've got the ruby bracelet. Mind if I have it? Sure, it's worthless anyway. Thanks. This thing, I made it when I was first starting out. I hate it. It reminds me of failure. 
I'm going to fix it. Make it better. Oh yeah, hammer that crap, the crap out of that. Oh, finally. A good ruby bracelet. Different, at least. Here you go. I never want to see it again. <laughs> moving forward with the ruby bracelet. Keep moving without dodge rolling or being hit to generate a kinetic aura, which can be unleashed by dodge rolling into enemies. What? When it says he will tie the enemies of the gun, you have come to understand from a gun, blah, 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 blah. Um, okay, well. Ammunition. Gold amulet. Probably will end up buying the ammunition. That makes a lot of sense. All the other stuff is like meh. Just buy the ammunition, fill it up. Um, we have opened all the room, all the chests. We're good to go. Fortunately, lead skin is going to save me a great deal of damage. Let's see if we can ace this mofo. <laughs> Get real, this nonsense. It's all. It's all happening right here. It's a massive ultra barrage of the most virulent aids you can possibly imagine. And the damage is kind of underwhelming. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Damage is a little underwhelming. But boy, does it look fantastic. It's amazing. But yeah, we won't destroy them. Oh, look at it. I didn't know that the mutation has a limited range. I thought that it was infinite range. But it only reaches so far. It's almost depleted. Wow. I guess we'll use it against the heart as well. Almost depleted. Glad I picked up the ammunition. Although now I am completely bereft of ammunition. Going into bullet hell. But we have other weapons. And hopefully we'll have at least one ammo drop. Just one in bullet hell. Yep, yeah, it did it. <laughs> well, what did I say in the previous run, or whatever it was? If the heart disappears in only one go, you have an overpowered gun. You have a good run going. And we actually got the... I never got the bullet that shoots the past, actually. Let's go over here. I don't think you get it with the Paradox, right? Yeah, that's right. All right, that's with the Gunslinger. So if you run without dodge rolling, you get this weird charge. Whoa. Oh, but only lasts for so long. That's so strange. Probably it's like insane damage. Probably it's the most amount of damage you can possibly imagine. I don't know, I can imagine a lot of damage. Alright, so here we go in turbo mode. Hell run. Uh, always touch and go. Always difficult to perform. Getting to the end. Of bullet hell is a nightmare. I'm going to use this until it's depleted because of the reason I always tell you guys. But I still don't know if it's 100% true. I'm going to look it up. Okay, now it's empty. But if you have empty guns in your inventory, you have a higher chance of getting ammo drops. I don't know if the Predator is the best uh, thing that I can use. But you know what? The stealth will probably be helpful. Remember, also have the portion of lead skin. Extremely useful. Active item. Oh yeah, nobody can see me now. Kaboosh! Not very useful, you know, when you don't have the gun friendship. Ooh, nice. Yeah, we'll fill up half, like half of the mutation cannon. It's 700 shots. That's, that ain't nothing to sneeze at, so... Nope. Ah, let's just go. It might not be a uh, dead end. We have seen so many times that what looks like a loop is not really a loop. And what doesn't look like a loop is actually a loop. That really doesn't matter. I think I want to do some lead skin here. I think that we would have been okay, but... Oh, there's a key. Yeah, there you go. Looked like a loop. It wasn't. Vindication? For my nonsense. So what matters here, of course, not don't take damage. Not taking damage. 100% the priority. Because that's really the only danger that can destroy me. And I'm hoping... To get to the Lich with enough 
health to say we're gonna be fine. Why are you shooting? Oh, one of these weirdos. Popcorn men. Killing those guys in two shots is, is decent. I think you get cursed people here no matter what, regardless of your curse level, because I think we've had zero curse so far. We just have to put up with the cursed fellas. These guys are the most annoying and dangerous. With the stupid bouncing bullets. All right, two more shots and the Predator is, I mean, the Predator cannon is depleted. I guess, Sniper. We're in level one Polaris. It's that uh, boat has sailed. There's no way. I mean, there is a way, but it is the way. That's the question right there. We could maybe get enough kills to justify the Polaris. So much work, though. It will be only a less recourse type of thing. But you don't see us in that situation anytime soon. We have lots of good stuff. Hey, another blank. Just carrying on. We did get one ammo drop so far, right? That was a purple or orange red ammo drop. Other than that, still pretty damn uh, dry. Where ammo is concerned, almost got myself trapped there. How about you guys just uh, exploit? Explode already, you fat boys. Well, this seems likely, so I'll just go up. Another cursed scumbag. We could just get uh, the potion here. And so, oh, you scum! <laughs> Am I immune? Nope, no, nope, not immune to lead skin. Why am I wearing this outfit? Oh, because I'm the paradox. I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, well, that was awful. But hey, it's our, our first point of damage, actually, so I should feel pretty good about it so far. And it was actually not incompetence. It was just... Yeah. It was simply the lead skin protection bumping us back because I got a little too confident there. So it was in a... You know, I chased down a bullet, made sure that I caught it with my teeth kind of situation. It was more like a, oh, well, oopsie. You know, <laughs> try to do better next time. Sniper shots. Taking the cake. Oh, that's right. I completely forget. Let's try and uh, use our weird thing. Hoo! I'm sure that's a lot better than what it just looked like. <laughs> I'm sure that's not as absolute trash. That's what it just looked like. Ooh. Out of here! Am I immune to contact damage? I don't know. I'm I'm trying to get the trying to get that little yeah kaboosh. I am assuming it's like insta kill. There's nothing that can withstand a headbutt from that. You know what? I'm very resentful that a sniper shot can get caught by these assholes. It's not right. It's not right. But now I'm incentivized to just keep running all the time, even if I'm not... Oh, wow, it's depleted, huh? Uh, the weird cannon... Uh, yeah, the Predator again. We did get a little bit of ammunition here. I'll just keep going the way I've been going. It's been pretty good so far. Six hearts, I'm feeling pretty good. So I don't take a ton of damage. I feel like we can make, especially with the gun that we have. The amazing boss killer we got is going to pull us through that lich fight. So as long as I got there, let's say I'm going to call it, if I get there, four hearts or more. I think I'm 100% likely to get the kill. Six, six shots here. I'm going to be depleted pretty soon. One more. Get me out of here. Careful with the shot that's still there. Uh, you know what? I run out of guns. <laughs> I run out of shots. I don't want to use my my insanity super taped mega gun to kill things. So here we are with the cold numbers. I'm sure Keanu Reeves 
lived during that year as well. I think it's 1851. Exploding. <laughs> oh, there's a scumbag trying to flank me over here. How dare you, sir? I think we can all agree on this. And I'm feeling pretty good about saying this. I do equally or better in turbo mode. <laughs> there's no improvement. Which, you know, take, take that how you may want to take that. There's no improvement in my performance. If I put it in uh, regular mode. I'm a bad, bad place. Bad things happen. Should I use my potion? Did not even think about it until I got hurt. Silly, silly, silly goose. Please give me a better weapon. I think we just need to uh, break down and use that other gun that we have. Hey, we made it! Holy crap! It took a lot of work. Mutation cannon! It's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. You know what? I feel like I want to use... No, that's not it. I want to use this thing. But it's kind of hard to get close to the guy, huh? No, that was not great. And I used my potion of lead skin right before he was dead. Alright, well, that was kind of dumb. Yes, yes, yes! Uber power! Let's see if we can use it against the this face. It's doubtful, though. It's so hard to pull it off. Alrighty. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> I mean, he's halfway there already. So I think I could just take damage every second and still get done. I'm going to save the potion of lead skin for the third face. Because I, I don't respect this guy. 142 shots, not going to be enough. But this phase is actually a lot easier than the rest of the fight, so... You know. Not worried. Ain't worried, bitch! Get wrecked! Oh, my ammo is gone. The thing is, I don't have anything else to use. So maybe this Tommy gun will do enough damage. Okay. Shoot this guy from the middle. Yeah, you know, we're going to limp through that finish line. But I think we're, <laughs> we're going to make it. I have four hearts still. And potion of lead skin. So our defensive capabilities are going to carry us, carry us through. Despite our arsenal running out of steam. Beautiful. Another gunslinger opportunity. Aren't you guys excited? How would I waste it this time around? <laughs> I don't know, but I look forward to finding out how awful and humiliating it's going to be. I hope that you too are looking forward to such things. Until that moment, just pray for my survival.